So this is Vince Outlaw and Ron Denis for PBJF.com and the New Jazz Thing.com heading to the Playboy Jazz Festival press conference. 2010 is the year, and uh, we are uh, heading up uh, today, Thursday, February 25th, 2010, to Bel Air um, in the Playboy Mansion for the announcement of the lineup for the 2010 Playboy Jazz Festival. Hey, Ron, how you doing? Hey, good, Vince. I'm glad after uh, four years we are able to get back up into the press conference. It's always exciting to see uh, who's coming to the Playboy Jazz Festival. One of the uh, country's most, I think, here, uh, at least on the West Coast, is one of the best jazz festivals uh, or music festivals you can go to. And I'm glad that we're resuming our contact once again to get up there and check things out and see who's going to be there for June of yeah. 2010. Yeah, I guess uh, I'm assuming it's going to be Father's Day again uh, this year, as it usually is. And um, so we're heading up to uh, Playboy Mansion. We'll uh, take a shuttle bus up there from uh, some place in Century City or Bel Air or somewhere near Westwood, and then uh, up to the mansion for some hors d'oeuvres, uh, a little bit of cocktails, uh, you know, and uh, some hobnobbing with the jazz folks in LA and, uh, and at Playboy Jazz. And then they'll do the announcement of the. Uh, the lineup for the Saturday and Sunday two-day event, and probably for the local events that they have uh, around the LA area um, that are part of this whole greater Playboy Jazz Festival season uh, that kind of opens today with this press conference. So, Ron, you've uh, you've been to the Playboy Jazz Festival uh, quite a few times. Uh, memorable moments, or like when did you first go? Or you know? yeah, uh, my first experience was 1981. Uh, going to the Playboy Jazz Festival. It was always a good experience at that festival because uh, the way the uh, Playboy Festival uh, people, they keep it on such a nice even keel of letting people do their thing and not get out of hand. And It's always a nice time up there. Yeah, it's, uh, it's a, always a really good vibe um, uh, at, at the Hollywood Bowl for that weekend show. And uh, it's a it's a great thing. Yeah, you know, Hefner's been doing it for uh, well, I don't know how many years. It's uh, got to be in the 50, no, 50 years or no, this is uh, 30 something or other. 30 something. Yeah, 30 something or other. Um, and so uh, Play, uh, Playboy supporting jazz, putting together a show which is a mixed, you know, a uh, very different, a lot of different styles, uh, but all really good music. And then as Ron said, uh, a great vibe. Um, and so uh, we're heading up today, uh, coming up the coast. Uh, the press conference is at 2. So follow at pbjf.com. You can subscribe to, um, you can uh, follow us on Twitter, uh, twitter.com slash pbjf. Um, we're also on YouTube if you just search for pbjf or Playboy Jazz Festival weblog. Uh, you can uh, see us there. Um, and. Uh, Hang out with us today um, online at pbjf.com. Uh, Ron, uh, oh, Ron, and uh, let's all thank Ron for driving. So that we yeah. uh, really appreciate you uh, you driving. Any uh, any last thoughts uh, before? Where are we heading for lunch, actually? Uh, I don't know. Any ideas? I'm just going to suggest that to you. I might take you to a very unique place called Roscoe's Chicken and Waffles. Oh, although we don't need those carbs, but it might be an experience for you. If we eat them early enough in the day, I think. You know, we'll burn them off. Yeah. Walking around the grotto and uh, and the grounds there at the Playboy Mansion. So, okay, well, uh, hang out with us, pbjf.com, and uh, you can even have lunch with us. Okay. Um, oh, um, shouts out to Dave Ossing uh, on Facebook. Uh, thanks for the shouts. Um, and Leslie, yes, we'll talk to the uh, bookends, or we'll try to see if uh, the bookends. And, you, and we can arrange something between you guys for some sort of a rendezvous, okay? All right, uh, take care. Vince Outlaw, Ron, and Ifu out for pbjf.com. Yeah.